We'll be back in a moment. Hi, welcome to Future Sport. I'm Vic Braden. With me, Charlie Jones. Charlie, great having you on Future Sport. Thank you, Vic. All right, you all know Charlie Jones as the voice of the AFL football, the original Super Bowl voice, but also you recognize his face, but not usually on the golf course. But Charlie Jones <laughs> has a problem. What's your problem in golf? Like every uh, high handicapper or weekend player, it's uh, direction and distance. Direction and distance. Every golfer's nemesis. We're going to show you golfing secrets on Future Sport you probably have never seen before. Aerospace technology and computers will be utilized to compare Charlie Jones to U.S. Open winner Jerry Pate. Smooth as silk, that's how they describe his stroke. Charlie, now we'll get a chance to uh, really take you apart, buddy. Well, that was, that was a lot of fun, because usually when I play on a golf course, uh, the only gallery is the golf cart. But here with the cameras and everybody you do, you get a little bit uh, a little bit tense, but the pressure's always good. I don't get to play that much, in all honesty, because they won't let you swing a golf club in airports now. That's when I spend most of my time, really. Always amazed when I see top celebrities, and you think, gee, they, they've performed before millions just the way you have. And then all of a sudden, they're out there in front of the camera themselves. They're performing, and they can get the tennis racket through, the club head down. They look like a toad. That didn't happen <laughs> no, to you. You look no, good to no, me. No, but, but you're right. But it's a different sport. I'm very comfortable when I'm working in front of a microphone or in front of a camera because then I'm communicating only with one person. But like you say here, you know, now I'm trying to hit my career golf swing today. <laughs> career golf swing. Well, let's see if you did it. We're going to go in right now and check out your high-speed film. 100 frames per second turned into technical data with our resident scientist, Gideon Ariel. With us here is Dr. Ann Penny. She is going to digitize the firm. This process consists of touching the joint center, and this screen is very sensitive to location. So every time Ann touches the joint center, such as the wrist and the elbow and the shoulder, this information going directly to the computer. Every frame of information going there in its process. And from that, we can calculate the displacement, the velocities, the acceleration, the amount of energy, the deficiency, and the advantages of every individual activity. Here you see Jerry Pate with golf classic swing. Extremely smooth, a strong full body turn, and notice Pate's straight left arm. On the right is our computer model of Jerry Pate. And on the left, we see Charlie Jones' comparative swing. As you can see, Jerry Pate turns his body more than Jones. He's coiling more his body segment and therefore can transmit more energy to the ball. We're using also holographic technology where we're putting Charlie Jones within Jerry Pate's body. Therefore, we can do comparative analysis between the two strokes. Well, Giddy, it looks to me as though Charlie Jones uses more arm and less body. Yes, Vic, but this is the illusion. People think that you swing with the arm. You really swing with the body. You use the intricate timing of the heavy segments of the body and therefore allow transmit energy into the arms. The arms going just for the ride. Vic, this holographic research and technology will allow golfers in the future to optimize the golf swing for the best technique. 